All right, hey everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Fran Bo here on the 13 Days of Monster Ween. And I guess we can start trying to click on all this junk. I know a story about a girl with red shoes. I like animals, all of them. Dogs are animals. Anyway, it's just a shoe, really. I should leave it there. It's, yeah, it's a, a girl with red shoes and she had a dog, yeah. Haha, <laughs> I remembered something funny. A very old uncle tried to blow one of these. Haha. <laughs> He farted all his gases out because it was so hard to blow. <laughs> Old farty uncle. Oh, this instrument is pretty. It reminds me of a snake that sounds like an elephant. And those tiny insects that roll themselves into bowls. It says Jant, and I have no idea why. Maybe it's just a meme. Uh, uh, I thought maybe it's just a meme like mine. Or Mr. Midnight. Maybe it's just a name. Ugh. Maybe a music maker that stopped loving music. What a pretty horse. The king would like this one. I'm not going back, though. He must escape himself. I wonder if they are looking for me. What about this piano? Ooh, I can play it. Wow, a piano, it sounds old. I can touch the piano and play with it, but certainly not play it. I wonder how the musician is out here in the middle of nowhere. Dear, your arm is gone. Good that you are not bleeding. I'm kind of tired. Of all the red milk coming out of everyone? Who dares to leave an innocent teddy with no sh without shelter, I wonder? Mr. Midnight, are you in there? I guess not. I'll keep searching. I think that's most everything we can interact with here. Unless there's... Oh, no, that's the bed, I suppose. Okay. It can be good to have a cozy place to stay. Well, if I'm very tired, I could use it. I guess I'm not sleeping until I find my kitten. All right. Let us progress then, shall we? Ooh, spooky tree. Hello, tree. Hello, tree. Hello, tree. All right, so uh, we've said hello to the tree three times, which is the magic number. Oh, God, those are huge. Um, hello, I suppose? Wow, this re is a really big insect. Or is it a pig? Well, it's very odd. Oh, wow, you really are a very big ant. Yeah, who's there? <laughs> Nobody, goodbye. Are you real? Oh, excuse me, sir, are you real? Ah, you always ask the same thing, always. Always? What do you mean by always? Of course I'm real. Where do you come from? Oh, I escaped the mental hospital, but please don't tell anybody. I won't tell, don't worry, but what are you doing here? Real bad things happened to me, sir, but now I'm looking for my cat. A cat, you say? Yes, sir, a black cat with very big yellow eyes. Mr. Midnight. Oh, I see. I'm sorry, girl. Oh, so you haven't seen it? It happens to be that the cat is eaten, chewed, and swallowed. Stop the nonsense. Sir, stop with the nonsense. I really need to find him. The black cat that came towards me in a hurry? Oh, the black cat that came towards me in a hurry. Okay. I'll catch it. I'll give it to me beetle pig. My beetle pig is hungry. Oh, my poor beetle pig hadn't had any food in days. The blueberry time passed by and we ate them all. Stop it. Can't you see Mr. Midnight is the only one I have? Everything, ev everything is wrong. Wrong. Oh, little girl, don't cry. I can sing for you if you like. <laughs> no, you are a murderer. You don't know how it feels to be alone. I do know, yes. I'm the last one alive. Let me help you, yes? How could you possibly help me? The digestion is not so fast, you know. Maybe he's still alive inside the beetle pig. Alright, so... But what should we do? Kill the beetle pig. He is the only friend I have left, but I need the meat. Uh, I'm curious to know if my kitty is still in there. Do it. You can kill the beetle pig, and I, Antonio the Greatest, shall eat the meat. Alright. Um, okay. I, I suppose we don't have anything to kill the beetle pig with yet, so... Unless he's allergic to green crayons? What kind of bird are you? You look like an owl. Is that it? Your feathers are beautiful. Alright. Oh, yo, what's a hedgehog? Uh, yeah, okay, I found an axe. Whoa, the terrible axe. 
I will be the warrior. I that went that went by too fast. I don't like how it progresses. I don't like how it progresses on its own. I like to control the pace of things. I do. All right. So now that we have the axe, we can. Uh, oh, that's a different colored bird. Hold on. I'm just gonna go back a few screens to see if there's anything we can do. We would chop up stuff back here. It won't do. What about the pills? We haven't seen the demon realm out here yet. Oh god, it's a bride! Ghost bride! Oh, it wants me to follow it. Okay. Oh, Jesus, there's a bunch of heads on the tree. Wow, these are very rare leaves. They look a bit sad and old. Maybe they aren't leaves. They are too white. Curiosity is damned. Damn you, curiosity! Oh, I like to be curious. Otherwise, how will you learn things? Anyway, why won't you allow me to take the key? What are you? What is the right question, but why should be more appropriate? Uh, I don't have the time to chat, sir. I want the key, that's all. Oh, but the key isn't ours, and it's not yours for sure. Please just give it to me. I want to know what door can be opened with this. We couldn't care less. The affection, or the affection towards you is simply none. You are very honest. I like that. I'm a person. Friend, pleased to meet you. Interesting. Tell us more. I have a cat. Well, I had one. He's missing now. I have to find him. Really? Yep. Yes, really. Now, please give me the key. Look, person friend, we came from the south, flying as always. And one of us got curious about this key, and all of us got stuck here. And because of our long hair, we can't get loose. I see, yes, long hair you have. Can I help you? We usually get stuck on trees, but we have something to fix that. A beautiful comb to comb our hair every time we get stuck. All right, do that then. There is a problem. A filthy thief took the comb. Now we are stuck forever. If you find the thief and the comb, you will have the key, deal? Yes, but what does he look like? It's a rat, a filthy narcissist rat. He took the comb to be beautiful. We couldn't do much, so he ran away with it. Please find it and free us from curiosity. I'll try my best. We will be here waiting. Oh yeah, I mean, it's not like you're going anywhere. This is where the beetle pig and ant guy were. Oh, 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 there's the beast. Oh, the bird's still here, huh? All right. What about here, though? Oh, well, I could try to open it and see what's inside. I can't move the dot. It's stuck. Just my luck. I can't force it with my delicate hands. I need something else. Make an entry? Uh, okay. Nice. What a bluff. There is no hole in there. Oh, a feather. Certainly I can use a feather. Oh, a feather. Tickle, tickle. I'll keep it. I like it. All right. All my forces united to do something unnecessary. There must be a meaning, otherwise it wouldn't be here. Oh, okay, so there is no there is no well then. What if we what if we draw a well on it? Negative. All right, so let's go back to the real world then, shall we? Well, the bird is gone. He has flown away. I suppose I have to kill the pig. He does not want to be slain. Oh, what if I tickle him? This won't work, huh? Oh, damn it. Alright, try and kill him. Oh, does he just keep running away? Wake up, the pig won't stay still. It seems that shouting and pushing won't help him. Maybe I have to try something more subtle. Oh yeah, like a, a tickle. Tickle, 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 tickle. Ah, the threat is great, great! <sighs> Sir, wake up now. I think the beetle pig doesn't like the idea of being killed. Oh, I see, but that is completely normal, isn't it? Yes, but what should I do then? You have to give him the special berries, the blueberries. Mm. I see, but where do I find these berries then? I shouldn't say this to you, but I have the right connections. They live inside my house. They have blueberries. My house is in that direction. Be careful. 
Oh, thank you, sir. Okay, so I can go that way. Did we did we ever do, use the pills here? I don't remember. Okay, yeah, no, nothing really changed here. Okay. I just wanted to double check. So let us go through to find this gentleman's house. Oh, that star is very bright. Oh, it's the kitty. Oh, no, kitty. Run, rip, rip. Look, Fran, I'm in danger. Find me alive. Find me dead. Beep, beep. Find me someday in a golden cage. Beep, beep, beep. <laughs> All right. Oh, some, some mushy mushes? A tiny little house. Hello, I'm Fran. This looks tasty. Should I? Maybe not. All right. Okay, so let's enter. Um, there is no smoke coming from the chimney. A mushroomy pipe on the roof. Why did he put a mushroom on the pipe? Maybe he lost it. All right, so let's try and go inside, shall we? This must be the ant's house. It seems to be open, but very stuck. The power of destruction will take it down. All right, I guess we're just axing everything then. Oh no, I broke the door. Well, now I can get in. Wait, was there something on the ground there? Oh shit, it's that girl. Oh, a doorknob, okay. It's this ghost. Bye, ghost. Oh, a paintbrush? A glue brush. Someone forgot to clean the brush. It's firmly attached to the door. Only old people are so fun, they do unexpected things. Oh, hell yeah. Some glue, baby. I like that. Glue's good. The queen meat? Oh, the queen of meat. All right, that's clearly an inappropriate poster. Wow, Ant Queen, I never saw anything like this. So Ant must be in love with her. I wonder how ant love works. It's all about the meat, I guess. Mm, tea time, sir. Um, what is this underpants? They smell good. Grandpa soap. So this means the big ant was naked? <laughs> Look at that face. <laughs> uh. Oh, he's got meat here. Even if I wanted to take the meat, I can't reach it. Yeah, why does he want to eat the pig if he's already got meat? I don't get that. What a cozy little lamp. There is water in the sink. Maybe Sir Ant likes to, dr to drown tiny monsters in there. Or maybe he's just a very clean ant. Probably likes to kill tiny monsters, honestly. Oh, what are these acorn people? Sir, you look so angry. Wow, you are very rare. Lady Pinecon, what are you cooking? Don't be scared, I just want some berries. Baby Pinecone, ha ha ha, so sweet. The blueberries, ow, that hurts. Alright. So what if I slap that, then slap her, slap her, slap her, slap her. So there's clearly something I meant to do in here. What if I just kill them all with the axe? What if I give them a crayon? No? Hmm. Yeah, I knock the baby over, and then the mum leaves. Oh, do I have to wait until, like, the mum's in front? No, because he still gets up and goes away. Okay. So there must be something I can do. Oh, maybe there's an answer with the pills. Oh, good sir. This is a maggoty hellhole. This is probably what this real place looks like, actually. I'm not taking that bag, not with all these ants on it. Fine then, kill them. Alright, so we can't take that either. Can we sit? Oh no, I guess we can get up on the thing and then take the meat. Alright. You wouldn't mind if I take a little meat for those who hunger? Alright. So I think what I need to do is I need to go ahead, take the pills, toss the meat somewhere. There we go. Then take the bag. Perfect. Then get out of here. Because the bugs want the meat. The bag, the bag shows an anti-bug sign. Hmm, the bag is open. Examine. Yeah, okay. The bag is open, so I... Oh, I use it, right. 
A rat trap and some sort of card. Okay. Exterminator. Oh, um, the text is almost gone. It says exterminator. Poor tiny monsters. That bug looks seriously mad. All right. I think I know what to do now, though. I think I slap this down here. Tip over that. And then I grab those berries. Alright. Oh, there we go. Got the berries. Okay, I just had to wait for it to happen. Cool, I got the blueberries. Now they locked me out of the house. I think I think that's what that was. They were like, oh, get out of here! I took my blueberries! Alright, so... Is there anything else we can do? We have the exterminator card, the blueberries, the crayon, the glue... I'm sure... Oh, wait, oh, oh wait, oh, hold on. What if I combine... Oh, okay, I can't write my name on it. I thought, oh, what if I just wrote my name on the exterminator card? So people know I'm an exterminator. All right, let's go back then. Um, let's see here now. I have the berries. All right, there's the berries. He'll stay still. Now we murder the pig. Oh, no! No, don't show me that! Oh, it's a rat. It wasn't a cat. Old man, you lied to me. I killed a pig for nothing. What? You're not my cat. Oh, miss, you saved me from misery. Good for you, but I was hoping to find somebody else. I assume that you are feeling disappointed. Who are you looking for? My cat, my lovely cat, Mr. Midnight. Oh, Miss Lady, I'm not very fond of cats, you know. A black one with very big yellow eyes was trying to catch me. Really? My cat is also black. Wait, maybe the cat is my cat. Oh, my lady, if he is, then he is the one in trouble now. Tell me, where did you where did you saw him in the last time? Place reading fast things can't do. I can show you. Follow me, please. It's not far from me. All right. Can I take the axe back? I want the axe back. I'm very sorry, Beetle Pig. I wish I didn't kill you. Can't take the blueberries. What about this man? The Beetle Pig is dead now, sir. Thank you. Now we eat. I can't. Just so you know, inside the beetle pig, there was no cat, but a rat. A rat? Oh, I'm so sorry. You see, my eyes are very old. I also have heart problems and a very bad back. I also suffer from narcolepsy, and sometimes I don't. <sighs> All right, he did. Wait, is this the rat that took the comb? Here we are. Somebody took him, miss. They just disappeared. Oh, my goodness. Could you be more specific? I wish I could. It looked like the earth swallowed them. If there's anything else I can do for you, just let me know. I'll be around. Are you not a narcissist rat? Excuse me, did you steal a hair comb? Oh, the hair comb? That shiny, beautiful hair comb? Can I have it, please? All right, then. But can you please comb my hair first? Yes, I can comb your hair. Yeah! Yeah! Look at that rat. He's like, oh, yeah, baby. He's like, oh, yeah, make me beautiful. Thank you, my, la Thank you, my lady. You are very kind. Nice. We have the hair comb for the, the heads. The curious heads. Let's let's help the curious heads out, shall we? Let us use on their hair. Here's your beautiful comb, misters. Oh, it's I guess it's a bunch of men. I thought it was ladies. Oh, see, we're we're helping people, not murdering them, no. Oh, you friend the person. You finally did it. Hope the key opens the door you wish it to open. Now we fly south at last. Goodbye. Oh, they're all like bugs of some sort. Oh, beautiful. Oh, beautiful. Goodbye, shiny misters. Have a nice trip. Nice. I got a key. Now we can go. Oh, no. The rat is dead. Rat, who did this to you? Was it my kitty? I guess it's always the whole thing. Okay, so I think what I've got to do is I've got to put the glue with the doorknob. Put the doorknob on the thing. Negative? All right, use with that. This won't work. Okay. Combine with... No. Yeah, I should place it here. 
Oh, maybe on the... No, because... Yeah, I should be putting it on here, shouldn't I? Not sure what to do with this. Huh. <laughs> Show them my card. A key, maybe? No. No. I combine the key. See, I knew I was supposed to put the clue on the handle, but now I can't put it anywhere like that I think I need it to go. Maybe I have to go back to, uh, back here? Maybe I have to put the doorknob here? Maybe that'll open something? Nope, it can't be done. Okay. Hmm. Where do I put the doorknob, then? Am I supposed to be in the demon realm? Or whatever this place is when I use the doorknob? Because, yeah, nothing over here looks like it should be interactable with anymore. But I thought I'd put it on the well, and I thought I could open it. Like a... Like an Alice in Wonderland door. Alright. What if I talk to him now? Do you have any idea of how to find my kitty? It depends, my lady. Have you looked around enough to find him? Of course, but it seems that whatever I do, it goes wrong. Oh, my dear lady, miss, I wish I could help you. But those who took your cat seem to be from another world. Maybe they had, like, a portal that nobody else can see. Who knows? A portal? What is a portal? A portal, lady, miss, is like a regular door, I think. I see. Thank you, rat. Bye. Maybe I can use it on the tree or the stump or something, or... see. I want to see if it, because it, yeah, no, okay, that was clicking on me. Yeah, so it obviously wants me to make, make a door. But, can I draw one? No. Yeah, there's nothing really around here for me to interact with but that. Yeah, it says, oh, make an entry, right? Yeah. Right, it says make an entry. So I'm trying. There is no hole here. Yeah. Hold on. Hmm. Even if it works, I don't. I wouldn't know for what purpose. Yeah. So I'm supposed to try and make an entry, but I cannot. So I have to enter this. Okay. So I have to enter this. Yeah. Exactly. Right. So now maybe I had to click on that three times. It's clever. To, uh, it's clever enough to find another solution. I think. What? Okay, so where do I go then? Because there's been no other place that would suggest I could need to glue a doorknob to it. Yeah, because all this stuff is just junk. Alright, maybe, maybe I'll go back into the, the regular world here for a minute and see if I can't find it. Or take a quick peek back at its house. Maybe there's something I, I, I forgot at the house. Because it is quite possible. Someone forgot to clean the brush. Of course they did. Um, exterminator. Yeah, I don't, I don't think I need that yet. This is odd. I thought ants never cooked their meals. But then again, I'm not all confused. I'm all confused, and he's not an ant. He's a man that looks like an ant, but no, he must be an ant. Alright. I wish I could sleep with my kitty on this bed, but I think that under the blanket will be a lot of creatures, like bugs and such, that would like to eat my brain. Uh, yeah, I'd probably be worried about that too. So yeah, I don't, I don't think there is actually anything in here anymore. Oh no, they locked the door. Did they? No, okay. They did. Okay. <laughs> did they? What if I get back up in here and try and take the lantern? No. I, I cannot take the lantern. Okay, so... Was there maybe anything else in the demon realm here that I was neglecting? Oh my goodness! A pest exterminator and he's dead! Sir, you have tons of ants on you. I think they are trying to steal your bag. Yeah, okay, so there's nothing else here. Hmm. I am at a wee bit of an impasse. It seems... Oh, the moon. Good night, Mrs. Moon. How is everything? You are very pretty tonight. I think you make night very scary, but it's all right. All right. 
Yeah, because there's nothing here either. It's just the cat in the river, right? Yeah, with the... Look, friend, I'm in danger. Yeah. So there's got to be something we can do with this. Right? Got to make a door somehow. Maybe we draw on the floor? No? Do you have any idea of how to find my kitty? It depends, my lady. Have you looked around enough to find him? Do you know the person who took my cat? Oh, my dear lady, miss, I wish I could help you. But those who took your cat... Yeah, so it's they're saying the same thing. So I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to put the doorknob on the thing. But it's not letting me. And there's no other interactable around here that would use a doorknob. Because it's supposed to be like some Alice in Wonderland crap, right? Like where you're supposed to be like, oh, look, there's the there's the entry. Make an entry. Yeah, there is no hole here. That's why you put a thing. If I use a key, maybe? No. If I combine the key with the doorknob first? No. Yeah, because it says make an entry, and I'm trying to do that. And I'm trying to use, like, the old... I'm trying to use the old, like, you know, Beetlejuice effect where you draw a door first. Yeah, there is no hole here, yeah. I can't, like, brush this stuff aside either to make it a clean top. So I do not know. Yeah, and there's nothing else around here. Maybe I put it on the rat. Nope. Yeah, there's nothing else around here that I can use to make a door. Hmm. Interesting enough. Well, I guess this is the best place to call it for now. I'll, I'll work on it and see if I can't figure it out if I forgot something. You know, there's probably something I missed. Like a tiny little thing I didn't pick up. You know, like, oh, I didn't go and get the twig from the berries. Or I didn't try and grab the axe again. Or something like that, you know? But thank you very much for joining me on this episode of Fran Bo here on the channel for the 13 days of Monsterween. And until next time, please take care, everybody. <laughs>